eyes. Baby, please wake up. You're gonna be fine. We're gonna travel, remember? We're gonna do that. So many things I want to tell you. So many things to say. Why are you waking up? Have you checked? No, we're not married. But I swear, if you tell me to leave, I... Come on, Dad. Hold on. Stay with me. You're all patched up now, I swear. All you have to do is open your eyes. Baby. Baby! Thank God! I'm so glad she's alive. I really am. But I can't... I made such a mess of everything. She wants to see me, but I just can't. I should just get out of here. I shouldn't have come back. She nearly died because of me, because of my selfishness. Why? Why? Why did I let myself fall in love? I've been doing this job long enough. I know better. Minimize the damage, Kim. Walk away now. You know she'll still be at risk as long as I'm in this job. But her voice on the phone, begging me to visit, to come back. How, how can she even want to be near me? I should have changed my number. My heart is what got her hurt. So what good does listening to that do? Fuck. You owe her. You at least owe her one more apology. Face to face. Hey. You wanted to see me. Yeah, it's good to see you. You're looking much better than... When you first woke up. No, I never left. I stayed here the whole time you were out. I didn't... <clears throat> I didn't run away. I was protecting you. From... from what? Are you serious right now? From me! The only reason you got hurt was because Maxine came to my apartment. I tried to get to my phone to text you to stay away, but I couldn't reach for it when I knew she was already on the edge. You... What did you just say? You still would have come? What? Why? You got shot! Because then it would have just been me alone. Well, so? That's the point. That's my job. Your job would have been to call the police. What in God's name are you thinking? You could have died. Angry. Angry doesn't even begin to cover it. I'm absolutely furious that you would value your own life lower than mine, and in doing so, almost get yourself killed. I had it handled. Okay, so maybe I didn't, but I signed up for the risks. You didn't. God, you weren't even supposed to come over that night. Don't touch me. It's my fault you're in the fucking hospital. It's not okay. I almost lost you. I got you shot. You stopped breathing. You were unconscious for days. I should never even have come back here. Why am I here? Why did you ask me to come? 
I don't understand. How can you still look me in the eyes after what happened? After I lied to you? I don't deserve your forgiveness. If I had just thought this through for longer than a second, it would have been pretty clear that this all... It's insanity. I have never fallen for anyone while working, even less acted on those emotions, and look where it got you. I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry. And I know there is nothing I can ever do to make this up to you. I have ruined your life. So please don't forgive me. Be angry at me. Scream at me. Throw things at me. Hurt me just as bad as I've hurt you. <laughs> Why are you like this? I can't understand how anyone can treat the one who ruined their life with such kindness. You're supposed to be angry with me. That's the reasonable response. While on the subject, remind me to shut off Find My iPhone. Why do you think, idiot, so that you'll never pull anything like that again? Honestly, I should just go. Get out of your life so I can't mess it up even more. Are you serious? Of course I still love you. More than anything. I did promise I'd take you to Rome, but do you still want me near you? Aren't you afraid you'll get hurt again? Hey, stay still. You're going to pop your stitches. I'm here, okay? If you don't want me to leave, I won't. I'll stay with you. I really shouldn't. The nurses will be absolutely furious at me. Hey, no, just... Stay still. Fine. Fine. Stubborn thing. Let me just... <sighs> there. Are you happy? Okay, fine. As long as you promise not to do anything stupid again. Not life-threatening or something that'll pop your stitches. Deal? Good. Come here and I'll hold you. I never thought I'd hear your heart beat again. <laughs> yes, you are. Please hold on to that stubbornness. I promise. As soon as you've healed, I'll book the tickets. And then we're off to Europe. You should sleep. I see your eyes drooping, baby. You're not fooling anyone. Don't worry. I'm not going anywhere. That's right. I'll be right here when you wake up. Sleep tight, baby. <laughs>